Dorothy Bullock School is now 22 years old, and the district is addressing needed improvements here and throughout the district. Hello, viewers. I'm Rich Davey, the new principal of the Bullock Elementary School. As one of the newest schools, we are getting about 10% of the projects in the referendum plan for September 30th. A more interesting percent is the 47% that the district is getting from the state as debt service aid. So the district can get $12.6 million in aid for our $26.9 million referendum, if it is approved. That will be your decision at the polls on September 30th. Let me show you some of the plan improvements. We will replace all interior doors and door hardware with secure doors and intruder lock sets while saving retrofit costs by using existing frames. Safe and secure classrooms are an important part of the 20th century school environment. Security is a big issue in school today. We are improving our vestibule doors and hardware and rerouting visitors to the school office rather than directly into the main block corridor. At select doors, such as the main entrance, we will be installing a new swipe card system. There will be new exterior and interior cameras. While we are here, let me talk about leaks. There are many leaks in the roofs, and we have leaks here in the vestibule. These leaks occur in hallways, classrooms, and special use areas and need to be repaired for health reasons and to prevent future air quality problems. Metal roofs will be repaired by single-ply membrane roofs that will be replaced with a built-up bitumen roof system. The roofs protect the building investments below them, and they must be watertight to serve their protective purposes. In this area, gutters are leaking and causing deterioration to the exterior walls. Soon there will be enough interior damage if this is not stopped. Much needed improvements will be made to the lighting in the gym and in the multipurpose room. Also, a new PA system will be added to the gym, so important announcements and bus arrival notifications can be heard, making student arrivals and exits safer. Classrooms will be upgraded with new magnetic whiteboards over the existing chalkboards. Shades will be installed on the windows, and technology will be improved everywhere. Other projects include technology upgrade throughout the school, automated controls for the HVAC system, new mixing valves for hot water, replacement of selected heating units, and other energy and environment upgrades that make for healthier schools and happier students. So, even this newer school needs improvements. Some of the older schools need even more. Please learn all you need to know about the referendum and vote your conscience on September 30th.